hiyo ndi inachunga devolution na senate ndiyo nyumba ambayo imepewa majukumu yote ya kuchunga devolution na 96 chapter 96 of our article 96 of our constitution 96 inasema senate ndiyo ya kulinda devolution na county governments pamoja na counties so rais hapo nimekuwa na wasiwasi sababu nimeona deputy president ameongea mambo ya kericho akiwa na uzungu sana na uchungu sana juzi mambo ya Kiambu county na mambo ya Meru county iko mzozano iko katika hizo counties rais na mimi unajua mimi nataka kusema ukweli wana ndiji wana deputy president Mnataka niseme ama nisiseme? Niseme ama nisiseme? Kama hapa Meru acha niachane na mambo ya Kiambu na Kericho. Kama hapa Meru unajua ukiwa governor wewe ndiye president wa Meru. Na president wanakuwa na deputy president wake. Nikifikiria rais wewe vile umeteso ukiwa deputy president Iyo serikali yetu ya Kenya ilianguka wakati wewe uliteswa na ukawekwa kando na president yule alitoka kiwakiti. Na hii mandeni na shinda mingi Kenya iko naye ni wakati wewe uliwekwa kando. Tukienda tufanye uchaguzi ya governor na deputy, president na deputy. Hiyo watu wakae pamoja kama mapacha mpaka mayako hii inaisha wanaendelea namna hiyo. Na wewe pia rais unajua ulisema utawahi isumbua deputy yako sababu unajua vile uliteseka. Vile uliamua namna hiyo. Mimi ningeomba maandamu governor wa Meru sababu wewe ndiye governor leo. Wewe kae ka, ka, ni chini na deputy governor yako mkae chini. Kwa mboma hata bwana wakikosana na bibi. Unaambiwa mkiweza kutatua hiyo maneno ninyi wawili vembeta sawa so, mtaweza kuambiana ukweli. Kwa hivyo mimi mjifungia kwa nyumba muweze kutatua hiyo maneno ndio Mary iweze kuendelea vizuri. Ama mnatakaji watu watu wa Meru? Ivo kwenda Meru ikuatana? Ivo kwenda toendelea to kuatene? Ambo ni baraba kwenda ugano katika Meru nione mkono. Kwa hivyo kama deputy governor na governor wangeamuka waone vile wananchi wanasema hii ni sauti ya wale wameweka kwa ofisi. Eh muka deputy governor uone vile watu wanasema. Hata wewe mama governor amuka uone watu yako wale waliwachagua vile wanataka. So listen to the people who brought you to these offices. Kwa hivyo mimi nikiwa seneta wenu sitanyamaza sababu lazima nichunge devolution na ifanye kazi. Hata nilikuwa nimeambia kamati ya devolution and intergovernmental relations watembe Meru ndio waweze kuwasikiza. Na kama mnataka pia wakuje mimi tupanga na Craig na speaker waweze kukuja hapa ndio Meru isonge mbele. Ninyi wa Meru mnajua president alinipea kazi huko kwa, kwa Senate. Na mimi unajua proto ikipangwa vizuri president deputy eh, speaker wa national assembly speaker wa Senate mimi niko hapo tu. Kwa hivyo nikiongea hii sauti ujue ni sauti imepewa heshima na president. Sababu so, amenipea kazi nikiwa na deputy speaker. Na hata ninyi wa Meru mnajua ninafanya hiyo kazi, si ndio? Sinafanya kazi yake vizuri. Mko na imani na speaker wenu wa Senate, deputy speaker. Kwa hivyo hii mambo ya kusumbuana tukiwa viongozi once we elected, let, let us stop it. Once and for all, we have bandi manazi ya siyasa hapa meru laisi na lazima tuambienu kweli. Ata higinu wamesema hapa, you know it is always good to do consultations. To do consultations. If there was a meeting to make decisions yesterday, you could have also involved Kaduri Moronge, Senator Wenu. Ndiyo tuweza kukubariana, tunaenda pamoja. Na rabuda yyo mudikubariana pia ngava na akua. Kwaabu ya ni kiongozi wetu hapa meru. Kwa hivyo ni vizuri tuungane tushirikiane wote. Let us not make a decisions which can really affect us, affect our environment and affect our growth. Kwa hivyo mimi msijaiongea mambo mingi namna hiyo. 
Kwa hivyo nataka nishukuru rais na deputy na mimi nikiwa hapa mehurumia pimia ni mzee wa njoli ncheke taratibu. My brother in Tore tumefanya kazi na we sana. Let us be seen talking because we don't talk. Let us be seen talking. Me and you, let us be seen in events developing Meru. Because ni kweli ni seme, we also don't talk so much with my brother. Na tumengangana na hii dunia, tumetembea kila mahali, but that relationship imepungua. Tupendane, tupendane soto tukua viongozi wa Meru, ndiyo tuweze kupereka Meru yeo tumbere. Mambo ya 2027. Mambo ya 2027 inasumbua siyasa ya Meru. 2027 iko mbali. Na yule mtu wako ile kiti yako akitaka kwenda juu ataenda akutane na wengine. Ukikaa hiyo hiyo huko utakutana na wengine watakuja kukupinga. Kwa hivyo unajua hata rais alipingwa last time kwa yundi ye na wakaenda interviews na candidates. Kwa hivyo tusisumbuke na mambo ya 2027. Hiyo Mungu atatupangia, atatupea president of course tuko na ye. Huyo ni lazima na deputy 2027 au tumewapea viti tayari. Lakini hiyo ingine kutoka hapo chini kwenda chini. Hiyo wanaume na akina mama watanjipanga sababu itakuwa kazi mzito hapo. Hapo itakuwa kungangana kidogo. Kwa hivyo asanteni sana Mungu awabariki. Hivyo mmefurahia rais kuja hapa? Mnafurahia? Mnataka leo atoe sauti ya kumaliza siasa ya Meru ili nasumbua? Mnataka rais amue? Wao wanataka mkono juu nione? Asanteni sana. Mimi nachukua fursa hii kumkaribisha